Alright, this is the Super Duper Mart, and I'm pretty sure there's going to be raiders in here because I saw some outside and they were trying to attack, like, civilians. But the civilians killed them just before I managed to kill the raiders. So I'm pretty sure there'll be more in here. Oh wait, yeah, I can see one of them now. Just try and stay out of the light. Oh, they've saw me. Thing is, I'll have a chance to use this Chinese pistol. Seems like a good weapon. I think she's using a Chinese pistol as well. Yeah, good thing I've got plenty of stim packs, so I'll just be able to like heal myself, like if I'm running low on health. But I could run out of stim packs if my like health runs out low. Well, well, if it keeps running low. Oh yeah, oh, quite a few of them now. Yeah, some of them have got assault rifles. Uh, I think I'll just use a hunting rifle now. It's going to take quite a few shots to the head, even with like a hunting rifle to kill one of them. Oh yeah, I'm getting more XP now for killing them because, like, they're starting to like scale on the character's level. Yeah, it usually does that on video games. So like, the higher level you are, then the more powerful like the enemies will be, so uh, yeah, a bit like Super Mutants, you get like different ranks, so you get like a normal Super Mutant, then you get like a Super Mutant Brute, and then like a, a Super Mutant Master, and like uh, yeah, pretty much the, the there's like more chance you'll come across like a high ranked one if you're a high level, but it's unlikely you'll come across like a high ranked one if you're a low level. Yeah, I think because it's on very hard, they might scale a bit quicker. I'm, I'm not sure if the difficulty makes a difference, but you do get more XP if you play on like a harder difficulty. Only on Fallout 3 though, not like Fallout New Vegas or Fallout 4. But that's one of the reasons why I really like Fallout 3, because you know, you get more XP if you play on a harder, harder difficulty, because it shows that you have more experience. So, therefore, you should get more experience points. Oh, plenty of ammunition. Right, so I need to f try and find some food in this supermarket. Or, like, medicine would be much nicer. Just for Moria to help her with a wasteland survival guide. So, I'm just helping her with some research. Yeah, I'm just going to help out with chapter 1 because there's quite a lot of things that you need to help out with on chapter 2 and I kind of want to get like to the main story as well. But I will do like other side quests as well. Oh yeah, and I've got the DLC as well, the Broken Steel, so I'll be doing like other missions as well on here. Yeah, I need to try and get more vats. I think I've got some jet, so I could use that, but I don't think I will. I don't think that's really going to be very effective. I may as well just shoot him. Oh, I can't believe he's still getting away. Yeah, some of them try and run away if you like do enough damage to them. And pretty much they'll just like regret fighting you, but sometimes they come back and like trying to attack you. But I don't really think they can like heal themselves. Oh, nice. Right, anything in the cash registers? 
Oh yeah, there's pre-war money. So I think that's like similar to normal money. Oh, one of them must have left behind a grenade. Alright, I saw another guy. I don't know where he's gone. Oh, so there is food in the Super Duper Mart. Oh, there's a pharmacy key as well. So if I open the pharmacy, then there should be medicine there. Well, th there's a good chance it'll be. Alright, I, I can't quite remember where the pharmacy is. I think it's... Oh wait. Raiders. I think it's like uh, just behind me, the pharmacy. I'm not sure. I'll double check because I think I remember seeing a closed door. So, you know, it might be in there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that must be the pharmacy there. Oh yeah. This is the pharmacy, it just said unlocked with a pharmacy key. So there should be medicine in here. Well, there's a few empty boxes, but... Nah, not much in here. Alright, I think some radars might have been out hunting or something and them, they've probably came back and discovered that some of the friends are dead. So there's going to be even more of them. Yeah, there's a few like radaways in here. Oh, some uh, Nuka Cola. Oh, there's the Quantums which increase your like action points. I keep thinking it's called adrenaline points because, you know, it's like a special thing. Well, a special abil ability for your character. So, I think... Oh yeah, yeah, I think that's what it does. But I think on Fallout 4 it just increases, like, your health in, like, a much bigger scale. Yeah, I'm carrying, like, more than what I should be carrying, so... Uh, yeah, I might have to eat some food or, like, repair some armor. Just all I can do is, like, walk right now. Oh yeah, plenty of armor that needs repairing. Oh yeah, I can uh, run now. Okay, so next video I'm going to take on those of our raiders that have just came in. And I'm going to be exploring DC a bit more. And I'm going to try and head over to Galaxy News Radio and find out where James has gone. So I'll see you guys next video. Thank you so much for watching.